G'day and welcome to 2023. Um, I've come for a ride down the Satterhip and I'm on this road heading down to a beach which is actually pretty cool. I'll spin it around and check it out. How's everyone feeling today? Any big hangovers? Any stories to tell? Well, if you watch my last video on New Year's Eve, my ride around from Longamat to uh, Hattier and Soy 6, 7, 8 and a bit of Soy Bacow and Tree Town, uh, I mentioned that I probably wouldn't do anything and I didn't. So, I just sat on my little balcony overlooking the pool and um, drank some beers and a little bit of Thai whiskey on the rocks with water trying to upload the video that I had made yesterday afternoon which seemed to take forever for some reason and it's probably because I don't have a MacBook Pro which all the YouTubers use uh, and video, video editing software so you see with my videos are just snippets that I take with a GoPro and then there's a on the iPhone there's a um, iMovie app and you can just create a movie and piece them all together so that's that's what you see when you watch those, these videos so anyway I'm a pretty simple person and uh, I don't have a lot of money to be splashing around on expensive stuff and I think they turn out okay you guys tell me if you think I need um, need to lay out 4,000 Australian dollars on a MacBook Pro and then pay the annual subscription for um, software or do I just keep doing what I'm doing change of plans um, I thought I was heading to a beach down this road but I'm not I think this might be the naval base so um, this gentleman here kindly say hello <laughs> uh, in very broken English has told me to turn around so um, I'll be back soon so this is Bangsaray Beach on New Year's Day and um, Typical Thai, Thai form. They're celebrating and drinking on the beach. So I'll just, I'll just ride down to the end. I'll ride down to the end and turn the camera off. Unless I see something. But I think it might be, uh, even with the media mod on, there might be a fair bit of wind noise. Pretty windy. In fact, I reckon it's, I reckon it's 20 knots of wind out there. down here you can probably see the white chop the white caps in the ocean there um, so Bang Saray anyone out there interested in uh, some condo tours down this way it's a, it's a fair bit cheaper than um, Patiar yeah let me know what you 
think and uh, I can make some make a video. So just on condo condo inspections in banks, right? I forgot. I've already contacted one one agent, but they haven't responded because because they're not working at the moment. I don't think, especially not New Year's Day. Stay tuned, and any other areas within within reach of um, patio, happy to go and check out. Uh, I know a few of you, few of you have asked for the dark side. Uh, I'm trying to organise to have a look at some fairly affordable villas over that way, and. Um, Bang Sand might be another good one. It's about, well, it's nearly an hour from Patia, but um, beautiful, beautiful area. Anyhow, it's Bang Bang Saray, New Year's Day, and all the tires are getting pissed. Probably be another messy night down on Patia Beach, I would say. I was talking to the receptionist at um, City Garden Tropicana where I am and she said, I said, what'd you do last night? And she said, oh, we just sat on the beach down at Patia and drank. I said, oh yeah, what time? She said, three. And she was at work at nine this morning. But that's what, the, the Thais just love sitting on the beach. What we, what we call in Australia and probably other places around the world, of course, a picnic, but their picnic is on the piss more so than more so than an Aussie picnic at the at the uh, at the beach. Although, having said that, there are plenty of Aussies that do have picnics and get on the piss. But it's mostly just families and a responsible responsible drinking. Anyhow, I'll catch you later. Have a go at the width of the tyres on this Ford Ranger. They're sticking out of the guards by about six inches. Anything goes. What an absolute shit fight. Have a go at the parking. So this is John Tim Beach Road. And there's two, two rows of cars parked. Two rows of cars parked. And must be a tie thing. They leave the, um, the handbrake off and, and leave it in neutral. Um, people just come along and sort of move the car so, you can, so they can get out. Beachfront, the strip between John Tien Beach and Pratamac. It's really nice along here and heaps of trees and shade. A couple of places to eat. Well, there's plenty of street vendors anyway. So I've sat on this beach once my mate Greg from Aussie in Thailand, YouTube. And, uh, had a pedicure and a manicure. Sorry, I just had a manicure. And a couple of beers in the shade. And, yeah, super relaxing. So I'm at the end of the road. 
road now, or the, it's kind of like a lane between John Town Beach and Pratamac. Sands Cafe, which is excellent. There's a good 7 Eleven across there. They do good iced coffees, espresso. Without, well, I asked without sweet, no sugar. So, um, one of the comments was their places to uh, places to get food close to the Sands condo, so I'll just quickly, just quickly ride, ride down here. So there's the Sands. Um, it's not direct beach front because there's a road in between and uh, quite possibly they're going to build something there, I'm not sure. But they're great condos in there. I've done a couple of videos, oh, it was a while ago. Um, but they're, yeah, they're great condos. Beautiful. The only issue is there's very limited undercover parking. Which was the deal breaker for my, for my buddy James. So, from the Sands condo, it's just a short walk down here. On the right is the Sands Cafe, which I just showed. 7 Eleven, then you turn left. Soy 5 and all up this hill is just lined with um, cafes, restaurants, cheap, cheap food, 100 baht haircut, there's a couple of bars, uh, summer of 69 on my left, Cobra Lounge, Flamingo, which I believe is a lady bar, lady boy bar. Uh, and on the left there is Hard Eight Salon. It's pretty nice. So yeah, pretty much got a lot going for it too. Coming down from Pratamac Hill, where the big famous Patia City sign is, and this takes you along beat the waterfront to the Barley High Pier. I don't know whether I'll be able to get through because I've had, I've had their big concerts there. Now there's a shit fight between them and 
government about who's going to pay to knock it down or if not, if they can't knock it down, uh, hopefully finish it. The views, the views from that building will be just bit of a ride around on New Year's Day. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want more of these, I'm happy to do them. If you, if you don't like them, tell me and I won't bother. Villa, pool villa, who knows? Good, I can get through here. Alrighty, happy new year. Well, I couldn't finish the video off without going down Soy 6 on, um, on New Year's Day. It's only early, 20 to 4. Let's have a look. streamers on the ground and did the New Year's Eve one.
filming.